Okay, let's get started. I already have my brows and my foundation on. So the first thing that I'm gonna do is use a Max Painterly Paint Pot. Sorry, sorry, it's a little bit blurry. And I'm gonna go ahead and apply this all over my eyelid up towards my brow bone to prep my eyes. Next, I'm gonna use Wet n Wild's eyeshadow in Creme Brulee. This is just a matte cream eyeshadow. Um, there's not one in the palette that I'm using, so I'm opting for this one and I absolutely love it. Now, I'm gonna use a master palette by Mario, and the first shade that I'm gonna use is the shade called Isabel, which is a light brown transitioning color, and I'm gonna go ahead and pop this into my crease with my Sigma E40 blending brush. The next shade that I'm gonna use is a color called Violetta, which is more of a deeper brown. It has kind of a red undertone into it. You guys know I love those type of browns. And I believe I'm using a MAC 228 brush. I will list it down below. I'm just gonna carve this right into the fold of my crease and I'm gonna really, really focus on building this up. Then after I build up the color, I'm gonna go ahead and blow it out with a fluffier blending brush. Next, I'm gonna use Tarte's Amazonian Clay Eyeliner, and I'm gonna use this with a flat brush and just pop this all over my lid. Pretty much what this does is that it helps with any color that you wanna place on top. It's gonna to give it a lot more vibrancy, it's gonna give it a lot more pop, so you guys will kinda of see as we go along with the tutorial. Now I'm gonna use a color called NYC, which is a very brown, bronzy shade from the palette. And as you can see, I'm just popping this all over on top of the brown cream um, eyeliner and it really, really helps enhance the color. And on top of that, it just, it makes it look so freaking beautiful. Then I'm gonna go ahead and just blow it out with my crease brush again. Now underneath my eyes, I'm gonna use a Tarte Shape Tape in the shade called Medium. I'm gonna go back on the eyes, but I'm pretty much done with the top. So I'm gonna go ahead and just brighten underneath my eyes because since we're using smoky colors, we don't want our dark circles enhancing. I absolutely love this concealer. It's such an amazing concealer. And then I'm gonna use my Beauty Blender to blend this all out. To set my concealer, I'm using the NYC Smooth Skin Loose Face Powder in the shade, I believe it's Natural Medium, Medium Beige. It's one of those shades. But I'm gonna use this to go ahead and just set my concealer. I absolutely love, 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 love this loose powder. If you guys haven't tried it, check it out. It's so amazing. Sets wonderfully. Then I'm gonna use a shade called Claudia, which is a smoky black shade. And I'm just gonna go ahead and pretty much run this along my lash line just to smoke out the shadow. And it's just gonna make it a lot more sultry and sexy. Now I'm gonna go ahead with Fifth Avenue and I'm gonna pop this underneath my brow bone and in my inner tear duct. With a really small blending brush, I'm gonna go back with the shade called Violetta, which is that deep brown. And I'm gonna go ahead and just dust this underneath my eyes just to make the whole look come together. After that, I'm gonna use NARS eyeliner. I forgot the name, but I'll list it down below. Don't worry, I got you. And I'm gonna put this into my waterline and also tight line as well. After I do that, I go back with the shade Claudia and I just dust this underneath my lash line just to smoke it out even further. Next, I'm going to use Benefits Mascara. I forgot what it's called, <laughs> but I will list it down below. And after I do that, I'm gonna pop on some lashes and then just go back with the black shade and make sure that there's no glue um, showing through my eyelashes. Next, I'm going to bronze my face and I'm gonna use none other than Too Faced Chocolate Soleil Bronzer in Dark Chocolate and we're gonna bronze our face because we want to look nice and bronzy and sun-kissed for this look. You know, even though it's fall, we still want that nice bronze sun-kissed look. Now for blush, you guys know this is my all-time favorite blush from Milani. This is Romantic Rose, and I'm just going to go ahead and pop that onto the apples of my cheeks. Now something that I also did, which I think is kind of cool, and this is something that you can also do to play with the Mario palette as well, is that I ended up mixing Fifth Avenue and Marina together, and I used that to actually highlight my nose and on top of my cheeks as well. It created a really, really beautiful, subtle highlight. I absolutely 
loved it. So instead of pulling out an extra product, you got one up in the eyeshadow palette. Hey, we multi-using these products here. <laughs> now I'm gonna use leftover foundation to prime my lips and then I'm going to use Max Lip Liner in the color Soar. Duh, what do you know? I pretty much use this in almost every damn tutorial. And after that, for my lipstick, I'm gonna use Dose of Colors in the lip color called Stone. And that is pretty much gonna be the final look. I really hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial. It's actually really easy to do. It's just a bunch of blending and packing on some eyeshadow and voila, you got a beautiful smoky, night out type of look if you guys enjoyed this video please remember to give it a big thumbs up if you're new to my channel what's up i hope you subscribe remember to comment down below and until next time i will see you guys in the next one